Gaze upon the sky Christmas on my mind Somewhere from a place up high above There's a song of love Travel to warm up every heart to be our light into the night bless us with a moment of serenity let it come to bloom Joyful Christmas news Hope will find its way to you Peaceful little lives Christmas on evening it's a little after seven o'clock and just about to edit the vlog and get it up i'm a little bit behind um we had such a lovely weekend away it was really lovely it was just just the two of us we went away we had saturday and then we we stayed overnight saturday and then we had sunday and we came back sunday evening it was lovely the christmas market was amazing i picked up these two really yummy jams um marmalade stroke jam um and i just wanted to show them to you so this one is so they're by fruits of the forage and this one contains 43 percent fruit and um they had their stall was lovely it was really busy and i was really lucky to get which one did he say i had the last jar I think it might have been this one was the last one. Um, and there was chutneys, but I was just really interested in the jams and the marmalade. So I picked this one up, which is the Seville Orange and Slow Marmalade. I absolutely love Slow Gin. The best one is the Plymouth Slow Gin. It is amazing. Um, and this one won the Great Taste Award 2017. And then the other one, which you'll probably giggle, is the Mould plum jam oh, it is amazing and that one won the 2021 great taste awards and um it was really lovely um everything about the store was really nice um it was great and um it was busy so i'm really glad that i managed to get the last one of this one so i picked them up so the other really lovely thing that i picked up was this really cute little santa and these i've you know i've wanted one of these for so long um the this is a german smoker um and traditionally if i if i've read it correctly um normally it would be there's lots of different ones you can get ones um miners carpenters working men um and traditionally they would have the um so i think he lifts off let's see if i can i haven't actually done it yet oh there you go and then you put an incense cone in that little space there and then the scent the smoke comes out of his mouth and so i um i saw this lovely stall and I'm not going to do that properly now, one-handed. And I filmed it. There was lots of them in different sizes. And they had an absolutely beautiful collection of ceramic little houses. It was like a little village. Oh, it was wonderful. A village of all these different shapes and sized houses, cottages. It was wonderful. Um, and they also had a little section that you could put an incense cone. But I really wanted one of these. And um, when I saw the Santa, I knew I had to get him. He's so cute. So that was the other thing that I picked up. Let me place that 
how am I going to do that? Let's see if I can do it one handed. I managed to put them back in again now. So let me know if you have one of these. Um, I'd love to know. And in my first vlog, I was I asked about Christmas trees. If you had a real one, a fake one, and also about your Christmas toppers. And I had so many lovely comments. So thank you. So. And then on the second vlog, I asked if you have a wreath at Christmas time and if you hang it up. And so on my on this vlog, because I'm going to try and ask you a question each vlog, I would love to know, do you like marmalade or jam? And if you do, I'd love to know your favourite flavour. Let me know. Leave a comment down below. Um, I have never attempted to make jam, but I would really like to have a go at making it. Um, the different flavours are just amazing and I'm really loving my jam advent calendar as well. So let me know, do you enjoy jam stroke marmalade? And if you do, let me know what your favourite flavour is. Right, I've popped that away and I thought what I'll do is I'll quickly show you my socks and my shawl, how I'm getting on. And then um, what I will do is you probably won't see me in this vlog um, but in the next one you'll see me um, so I cast these on when we were on the train and this is how far I've got with them and I have my cute little Robin Red Breasts Progress Keeper there from Lindsay Simply Serving she designed she um, drew this beautiful Robin and designed and produced this really cute um, stitch marker, which I've, I have sold out of him now. Um, there might be some available in Lindsay's shop. Have a little look. Um, but he's so sweet. The yarn is lovely and I'm really enjoying it. And that's the West Yorkshire Spinners yarn. And I had some really lovely comments on Instagram about my project bag with these grumpy cats. They're so fun. And then this is my shawl, which I'm making. Um, this is a crochet pattern and it's the Just Feel Festive shawl and I've done two colours. I'm hoping the camera is picking up the slight, it is a fade so as I add each one um, you should hopefully see the fade. It's going to be so pretty when it's done. So this is the next one that I'm adding in and I'm using an advent calendar from last year. So I'm hoping to edit the vlog and get this one added and um, a couple of days behind um, but hopefully the great thing about crochet is it doesn't take long um, it's really quick to do and plus because I'm holding the yarn double as well it's working up a lot faster that is it I'm gonna love you and leave you and get the vlog edited and uploaded hope you're enjoying the festive season so far and um, I look forward to seeing you in the next one. The stars brightly shining It's the night of the dear Saviour's birth Long lay the world in sin and error pining Till he appeared and the soul felt its worth A thrill of hope The weary world rejoices For yonder breaks A new and glorious morn Fall on your knees Oh, hear Christ was born